Hi guys, this is Daikin VRV4. We have two units that are connected to each other. One is a master and one is a slave. Usually master unit is bigger than the slave, but you can have multiple units the same size and capacity um, which sometimes makes it a bit harder to identify which unit is master and which one is slave but in this case in VRV 4 and 5 we are able to identify which unit is master and which unit is a slave from outdoor function settings we have bs1 bs2 and bs3 buttons by pushing the mood button or bs1 once we are entering the monitoring mode The display will show monitoring mode which is number one and then zero zero now that we are in monitoring mode we can use bs2 or set button to select different setting numbers for example if it's zero and we push the return button once it will show the master or a slave unit in this case displaying zero which it means this unit is a master if we do the same on the other unit into monitoring mode and then I just push the return button once and it displays one it means this is a slave number one if we had one more a slave unit it would display two it means is a, a slave number two to return back we just push the mood button once there are a few a few set uh, numbers that we can use which are helpful uh, I wrote some of them here but I will I will add a photo of the full set number details of the monitoring mode um, this is some of the some of the numbers for example if I want to use uh, if I want to know number of indoor units connected to this system I push the set button 10 times so I will go in a monitoring mode by pushing the mood button once it displays 100 and then I push the set button 10 times until it displays 10 and then I push the return button once and it displays the number of indoor units connected to this system so in total 13 indoor units are connected I push the mood button once and it goes back to the original display so another example that we're gonna do is I want to know the let's say 
ambient air temperature which is 50 so I go mood button once and I go I press and hold until it displays 50 When it shows 50, I push the return button once and it shows 14.1 degrees is the ambient temperature. The last one that I'm gonna show you is, let's say, inverter compressor discharge temperature 47 so mood button once and then I go and select 47 the wind is really blowing here so apologies if the sound quality is not that good so I selected 47 and I push the return button, it displays 56 degrees Celsius is my inverter compressor 1 discharge temperature. If I have a second inverter compressor, it would be 48. Um, I will add uh, a picture of full function settings in the description of the video thanks for watching